It's 6.30, the first day of fashion week. Let's go! <laughs> Good morning guys. I'm ever so sorry for how chaotic the last clip was. I basically woken up at 6.30ish and checked my phone. I had text my agent saying that I booked the show that I did a casting for yesterday. So I was very excited for that because um, yeah, it's a really cool design and I'm very excited to walk it. Should be some really cool people there and definitely some amazing looks. So I was so not excited to wake up so early and I was dreading it. But as soon as I woke up, I was shattered. I checked my phone, saw that message, and I was no longer tired. And I was in a good, good mood, as I am right now. But I've just gotten ready, so I've just straightened my bob. When I woke up, my hair was in every single direction possible. I did blow dry last night pretty straight, but um, you know when you sleep with it, like slightly damp, it just goes a little bit crazy. But I've sorted the mane, and it's looking very lovely and sleek. And then... In terms of makeup, I've literally just got concealer, eyebrow gel, and lip liner on. I also have been doing this a lot recently anyway because I'm just embracing the natural features, you know. So basically, I need to explain to you the schedule. I have a rehearsal for a show at 10 a.m. I'm not allowed to wear makeup for it, but I'm going to a show now at 9 a.m. And I want to be wearing makeup for it, so I'm going for like a nice little natural in between, just easy to get on and off. But I have the most jam-packed day. Literally yesterday, I was looking for a driver to actually drive me around. I was like, calling all my friends, like, can please someone that can drive, just drive me for the day, like, I'll pay you. Because the amount I'm going to spend on Ubers, the amount I'm going to be running from tube to whatever, I don't know, is stressing me out. But we'll make it work. We have about five shows today from 9am. First one's 9am, last one's 9pm, and it's pretty jam-packed in between there, so... Wish me luck, but I'm gonna quickly film a little get dressed with me for TikTok. I've got some cool outfits to wear, so I'm bringing one outfit with me for a specific Natasha Zinka show, and I need to be wearing one of her dresses. So bring that with me. I'm a makeup and everything, so I'm gonna bring like a slightly larger bag than I ideally would bring, but all good. I'm just grateful to be alive. <laughs> Can you tell I'm in a good mood? Fashion Week has begun, and I can do it. <laughs> I'm ready and show my outfit. So cool. So cool. Okay, this is the jacket. Really cool. Had these amazing buckles. Open chest, little open neck. Really love the shape of this. As I said, it's yeah, Anderson Bell. So cool. We've also got this silver bracelet on. Love, love, love. And then my kilt is from George and Luca. It's just a long black. Pretty simple pleated kilt. Love it. And I've got on my tabbies and my little earrings from Anthropology. Okay, I've just come out of the Paul Costello show. Really gorgeous, very lovely. I'm also out of focus but I'm running to the station because I have a rehearsal for my show later at 10. It's currently 9.35 and it's like across London. I'm currently in West and it's in East. So I'm like running to the station. Well, not running, but a brisk walk. Hopefully make it in time. I might be a little bit late, but it's okay. But the show was really gorgeous. Um, very like nostalgic music, you know, very old money, which I expected of course. But yeah. It was lovely. Okay, I made it to the show. Introduce yourself. Hi. <laughs> um, we just stopped off at Starbucks to get some food and drink, but um, they're running a bit behind, so we're actually okay for timing because we were both like 20 minutes late. <laughs> but yeah, I'll show you guys when we're inside and doing the rehearsal, but I'm a bit stressed about timing for everything, <laughs> but it should be okay. <laughs>
I'm in actually like a really alive mood right now. This morning, not so much. Today is day two of London Fashion Week. I'm having a quiet morning. Thank God, because I was out for like 14 hours yesterday running around from every part of London and it tired me out, let's just say that. So I had a nice lion this morning and I'm just doing a little bit of skincare to get me prepped because I'm heading out in like an hour or so and when I woke up this morning after my lovely lion I got a call from my agent and she was like good news and she said that I've booked another show to walk today so woohoo if you watched my um preparing for fashion week vlog which I'm literally just about to edit now if you watch that you will know that I had a casting with like literally like 500 girls I was in there for four hours it was one of the busiest most hectic castings I've ever been to and I thought it went really well like the designers were looking at me and um took photos of me after I did my walk which is always a good sign but there was literally like five six hundred girls so I was like you know the odds of me booking the job of 25 people is not looking likely but my agent called me and said that I booked it and the show is at eight today and I'm so excited and I can't believe that I actually booked it I'm really proud of myself and my walking practice is obviously coming clutch so my call time is five gonna go there do my rehearsal fitting hair and makeup everything fashion shows always so last minute like the fact the show is today my call time is five and I found out at like 11 it's crazy but I'm very glad that I booked it but I'm gonna just chill for the next hour and edit some of the vlog I've got like a lot of footage from the preparation vlog god I can hear football chances on my window I've got loads of footage from the preparation vlog yesterday's vlog all of it so I need to get a bit on top of that so I don't post the vlogs really late so I'm gonna do a bit of editing now and I'm just currently lying in bed but I also just clean the flat a little bit because my boyfriend comes back from Egypt tomorrow and I want the flat to be tidy but I have been so crazy busy this whole 10 days that he's been away I've literally been running around like a headless chicken so I've had no time to actually sit in the flat like this is the longest I've been in the flat in weeks and it's only been like two hours I did like a little clean up not like a deep clean or anything but just cleared some stuff away so it looks a little bit more presentable when he comes back but yes I will update you and I am dressed and ready obviously I have to do makeup or hair because it'll be done there so I'm just gonna go super casual and I have a show at nine tonight that I'm watching and I really want to go because it looks really cool but this show is at eight that I'm walking so just depends if I can get there in time. I mean, it's not far away from the location. My location's in Shoreditch and um, the show afterwards is in Old Street. So I'm hoping I can maybe make it. It says on City Map that it takes like 20 to 30 minutes. So if I'm done by half eight, then hopefully I can just like run to the next show because I would really like to see it. But I'm going to bring an outfit in my bag if I do make it because I'm just going to go like comfy to the show I'm walking. But I'm so excited! I'm so excited. Um, yeah, stay tuned. I'm so glad that I can document this all for you and for me to look back on and be like, well done, Matilde. You did good. So, yeah, I'll catch you in a bit. I've just finished walking my show. I'm in a long black wig. It's crazy, but I haven't vlogged anything because it was so stressful. Like, there was no time to do anything. So, I literally was in such a rush. But yeah, I'll show you guys all the videos and photos when I get like, the actual professional ones back and insert them in, but very fun. Love the look. Oh, Fashion week killed me off and I didn't vlog half as much as I wanted to. I also missed like two thirds of the shows I was meant to be going to see, which was so annoying but i'm glad that i did the stuff i did it was super super fun and i had a ball and i said a ball <laughs> but i'm editing the vlog now i'm going to insert the pictures from my walk here for you guys to see because i vlogged nothing i did vlog a bit more on my tiktok for that day if you want to see but that's all for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed fashion week is now over i didn't vlog day three either i'm such a bad vlogger i'm really sorry but i'm back at uni now and i'm going to do some more week in the lives 
I'm a fashion student, which should be fun. And hopefully have some cool bits to show you. So stay tuned. I love you all. Have a blessed week. Mwah.